<laughs> Hello. What's up, Jam's image? Alexa, skip song. What's up, Rachel? What's up, Oliver? I miss you, man. I miss all of you. How is everyone? <laughs> Hello, Oliver. Nothing much. How are you? Just kidding. I talk to you every day, Oliver. Uh, Tiki's right here. Tiki! Hello, Tiki. Come here. Do you want to say hi? She's, she's a little sleepy right now. She's, you know. She's just gonna chill. How are you guys today? Today's the day. It's a big day. Sun to rise is coming out in 11 minutes. I'm excited for you guys to hear it. Who's excited? Tiki is cure. I don't know what that means. That's some lingo I am not uh, hip to, but I, I think that's a good thing, so thank, thank you. Wait, let's see. Oh, that's the wrong way. Cool. Let's try this. Let's try this. If I do something. Okay. Seems like there's enough of you here. Let's chat. How's everyone feeling? Is everyone excited? Uh, I promise I'm going to answer some questions that you guys, you, okay, oh, uh, I'm gonna answer some questions that you guys were asking me. And if you have any other questions, wait, can you not hear me? A lot of people are saying they can't hear me. What just happened? Can you hear me? Oh, can't hear me with the filters. Okay, I got you. I think I'm back now. All right, one second. I'm just getting some some questions here. All right, you guys ready? Oh, thanks, Oliver. All right. Here we go with the Q&A. Thank you for those who sent questions. If you have more questions, send them all right here. Here we go. Rusher and R5 says, do you have a story behind your next single, Sun to Rise? Um, Sun to Rise is about when the world seems a little dark or not on your side. If things are not going your way, whether it be like injustices in the world or your own personal problems or whatever, if things are going badly sometimes uh, for the sun to rise. That's what this song is about. And it's very much like, Alexa, pause. Can't concentrate. Um, it's very much about, or it's very much in the style. It's, it's, a, it's like a love letter to my early musical heroes. It's got a lot of Jack White, Black Keys, early Black Keys things in there. And I don't think I'm ever going to make, I'm not sure. I'm, I wasn't planning on making us like having this be a part of the sound, but here we are and I'm stoked about it. And I'm, I'm very excited. Um, I think you guys are going to like it a lot and yeah, it's got like a more garage rock sound. Oh, I went there for this one. All right. Next song. I'm sorry. Next, uh, question is what I meant to say. Uh, how many songs do you plan to release? 
Well, I'm Theo. Uh, there is going to be an EP coming out with a couple songs. Two more songs, I, I believe. I, I don't know if... Yeah, I can say that. Uh, sometime soon. Month-ish or so. Not sure how much I can say. I don't know. That doesn't really matter. Uh, but yeah, that's coming out soon. And there's going to be more songs. And I'm excited for you guys to hear all those. And then who knows? Maybe some live streams? I don't know. Whatever you guys want. What do you What do you guys do? Would you guys like live streams? Things like that? Yeah? Yes? Yes. Good. Do you have any idea, name ideas for this EP? Uh, what's up? Um, I can't tell you yet. I have to announce that later. That's for another, it's for a whole nother live stream. All right. In due time. Uh, Mila Bonico asks, what do you enjoy the most about creating music? Well, oh, sorry. I totally said that wrong. Milal, Milal Bonico. I don't know why I said it the way I said it before. So, okay. Uh, I enjoy the moment. There's a moment when you're writing music and it starts to sound really good or, you know, some, a lot of the times you're like, what do I say? Or like, why is it sounding bad? Or what do I do? Or who help me? And everyone's, and there's no one there because you're just by yourself in a room. And the moments where you're like, oh, this is good. Oh, this feels nice. Or like, or like you get a mix back or a master back and you're just like, yes, finally. Those are the moments that are the best about writing music or when you like get that line and you're just like hmm that's a good line there's a couple of of those moments I feel in this uh song I really like the opening line because I don't know I can be proud of my own line that's fine right that's not that's not cocky I think that's good yeah confidence okay uh how are the plans for merch going well cookie graylet um they're going, they're, mm, mm. I need to figure out how, I think I'm just going to like, I don't know, I'm going to figure some things out. I think I'm, I think I'm going to just do some, some DIY, get my own little screen printing going. Would you guys like some DIY homemade shirts from Ellington made with these hands? Is that something you would be into? Anyone? I'll wait for the comments till it takes a second. Oh, what up, Alti? I don't know if I can, is that a, is that a nickname that I can call you? Alt, Alt, Alt Bloom. We want merch. Thanks, Rachel. Uh, will you ever make a rap song? Cause I'm definitely waiting for it. I will never personally rap on a song. I don't, I don't know how to do that. Uh, but I do love rap music and I would be super like, obviously if there's any rappers out there, if, if, if anyone knows anybody, tell them to slide in my DMs because I would love that. Uh, who would you like to collaborate with? My favorite artist is James Blake. Um, I, uh, I also like, there's a band called Salt, S-A-U-L-T, all caps. I talk about them all the time. Like, I, I feel like if you've seen me, like a story of mine, you will know that I talk about Salt like, consistently. Uh, they're like this London like secret duo but it's really this like producer named inflow who works with uh danger mouse and it's the best so hey if that ever were to work out that would be i would i would get really nervous and probably cry a little bit but it would be i think it would be really cool all right let's get some more um because we got three minutes till the song comes out uh all right let's see let's see let's get some let's get some Let's get some three pointers here. Are you looking at this again? Sorry, you're just getting carried away with your inspiration. Um, that's good. At, uh, or Ori Solange, uh, are you looking to do some kind of musical style, or are you just getting carried away by your inspiration? That's a good question. That was a lot of the first couple, like six months of me writing my own music, was just like, can I? Do I want to? Do I want to do this? Is this the song that I? Finding a sound is is very time consuming. It takes a lot of um, a lot of time 
especially when I'm coming from like other projects and things like that and being like, well, I don't, well I, uh, uh. Uh, so I think these two songs that want the EMT that have, that that's uh, come out and then Sun to Rise are two, they're not, they're kind of on the polar opposite sides of like the genre that I fit in. They're like on the two spectrums. So the rest will be filled in with the EP. Uh, all right, let's see here. Oh, will there be a music video? Um, there is going to be a music video. So I spent the last like week of my life um, creating said music video, and it'll be coming out in a short amount of time, a couple weeks, two weeks, maybe. Uh, and it is completely made from flash photography. So I did a little like... It was like, it was a ridiculous idea and somehow, somehow it worked. Um, so yeah, literally, so it's got like a, like a stop motion kind of vibe. Are there other questions here that I can click on? Oh, that's new. Okay. Uh, someone asked for my favorite seventies and eighties band. All right. I guess we're going to end it on that. Uh, I really like talking heads, I guess it's like, this is like the one eighties band that I really like and then 70s it's like who where do you start you know i guess led seven oh fa okay last one favorite song at the moment um favorite song at the moment I'm, just, I'm gonna really take this oh this is a song called pink and blue by outcast that is on the love below or slash speaker box sub sub mark uh speaker box um album that I've never heard and I heard on like KCRW a couple of weeks ago and it's dope and it's super sultry and Andre 3000 is the best for those youngins who don't know about Andre 3000 uh go go look into all of our Andre 3000 if you've heard Blonde you've heard Andre 3000 uh all right well I think it's out let's double let's double check here Let's make sure all the things, all the wires were crossed in the right way. Checking my Spotify. Let's see how we're doing here. Does anyone see it up? Sometimes these things take... Oh! We're in business. It is here. Oh, interesting. Interesting. Oh, interesting. All right. It's here. Go stream it. It's on, baby. Um, yeah. Check it out. Sun to rise. Listen to it. Let me know how... Uh, let me know what you think. Listen to it a bunch. And... Yeah. Oh, also, this was the first song I ever wrote. Or, like, really finished. Um, this was, like, way before EMT. So, this is... This is that fresh Ellington genre... Ellington, like, newbie, I don't know what I'm trying to say. It was early. And so, yeah. All right, check it out. Let me know what you think. Um, share it. Post stories. Tell me, tell your friends. That stuff. Thanks, guys. All right. Ellington, out. Peace. See you guys later. Okay. How do I? Yes? Okay.